Ever wondered how cervical cancer procedures are performed? Let's take a closer look at the steps involved in treating this condition. Cervical cancer is often treated through surgery, and one common procedure is called a hysterectomy, where the uterus is removed. Before the surgery, doctors perform various tests including imaging, scans, and biopsies to determine the extent of the cancer. Once a treatment plan is established, the patient is prepared for surgery, which typically occurs under general anesthesia. The surgery begins with the surgeon making an incision in the abdomen, either through an open method or using minimally invasive laparoscopic techniques. If the cancer has spread, nearby tissues and lymph nodes may also be removed. To ensure complete excision, the surgeon carefully separates the uterus from surrounding tissues, including blood vessels, and then removes it from the body. After the hysterectomy, the surgical site is cleaned and closed with sutures.